Right, good evening. Who is the first one, Renee? Renee? Can you hear us? Let's first check if you all can hear us. Hey, guys. Let's just say there, Jam, Robin. Yes, yes, they can hear us. And I think uh, I need to, before we start, expand our video here so that um, I want to show you Dimitri has cut off his hair. He doesn't want to show us his hair. I'm, uh, yes, I'm, I'm, I'm like a savage person. Look, I, uh, <laughs> I need to... <laughs> yeah, with this right. uh, no we hair, all hair cut are not haircuts are not working right now so it's it, <laughs> yeah. it's, it's rough times call yeah. says wild I, thing I see, right yeah man i see that you have a you have a stylist in your family or something uh no 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 when did i have my haircut we went in lockdown a week ago i had my haircut just before that so i'm i'm lucky i i, I got it in but Two, three weeks from now, I'll be in the same situation as you. Right, let's quickly see who's here in the room. Say hello to everybody. Oh, it's a long list, but good evening and good morning and good afternoon, everyone. Uh, we are very, very happy to see you all here. And, and we hope we can give you a little bit of entertainment tonight and, and some news and something that you can ponder on. So let's just jump back there to our our intro slide, and we'll quickly go through what we are going to do tonight. And as always, if you cannot hear us very well, then it means you have to maybe just refresh or use a different browser. We've had very good comments from Chrome and Firefox. These two get thumbs up. The others are there. So especially we know some people sometimes struggle on Safari. Just switch over for this webinar and try a little bit different. Um, Heidi, good evening. Oliver, good evening. Canada, Germany. Uh, we uh, should the list goes so quickly. Ireland, Peter Kenny, good evening. And Bulgaria, we have Mullen. Uh, I hope I pronounced that correctly. In Philippines, hey, you guys should be sleeping over there in the Philippines. But I guess it's it's better to join us over here. Let's move on tonight. We are taking one step towards Brizzy Cloud CMS. Just a quick reminder, then, everyone, as you know. And the, the, those numbers are dropping. So our Lifetime Pro WordPress license is going down at 687. Dimitri, was this the latest count today? Uh, yeah, it was uh, the latest, latest count. And um, um, we were discussing if we should uh, include uh, this slide in, in a, right? We are, uh, we are uh, promoting a WordPress Lifetime uh, license, but we are holding a Breezy Cloud webinar, right? But uh, it's, it's important to be here this slide because uh, I'm not sure you all guys know this, this uh, lifetime uh, pro WordPress license uh, gives you also access to uh, two years of Breezy Cloud Studio plan. So it's, uh, it's basically two years of unlimited Breezy Cloud. So it might be something you, uh, you might want to take advantage on, especially that uh, the price will... Uh, will uh, uh, this is the last time you'll be able to get it at uh, 299 so yeah right so last time at 299 us dollars after this the lifetime license price will increase and trust us we're not going to have specials running on that uh, so if you want to grab it at this nice price you have to do so now washington good evening i see florida also there ukraine uk uh whoa 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 so many people joining us we are running already over 150 attendees tonight looking good so just quickly what we are going to do tonight is dimitri is going to show us what the team is working on right now and then talk a little bit about moving brizzy clouds as a scms which is a content management system and just quickly you know, often we use these words, we become so used to this lingo, and then people will ask me, hey, what is this and what is that? A content management system is basically the platform that we use to build websites in. For example, WordPress is such a system, a content management system. It's just a big word for the app in which we can build websites in. And Brizzy Cloud is by itself a content management system. That's what we will be discussing tonight. And also some of those changes to the Brizzy Cloud plan. And then uh, a cool thing, maybe. We'll show you maybe a, a cool thing, right? So 60 minutes or so, and tonight we're very informal. That's why Dimitri didn't comb his hair. And I'm wearing the same shirt that I realize I've basically worn in every webinar. So I do wash these in between webinars. Don't worry about that. <laughs> just, 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 a quick, uh, just a quick disclosure. I've tried desperately to comb it, but... Uh... 
It doesn't uh, <laughs> doesn't uh, take. So uh, yeah, I'll, I I had an idea just the other day talking with my wife. I said uh, I'll uh, I'll put my my razor machine and just go uh, just go uh, bold. Skin it on uh, yourself, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Your children won't be able to recognize you. So we're just going to have a very informal chat tonight, show you a few things here and there. Please put your questions over in the chat, and uh, it's very active there. What we can answer, we'll answer, but as usual, support, we're not going to be able to give you answers on that. Do so at support.brizzy.io and submit your ticket over there and try and keep it to the topic. Uh, we have no hopes that you will keep it to the topic, but we will ask you anyway, try and keep it to the topic. Quickly about me. Well, usually we should change a little bit of this. A lot of this has changed. Uh, I'm sitting over here in South Africa. We went into lockdown exactly a week ago, last Friday. So we are isolated. We cannot go out at this moment, only essential services and go buy food. I know many of you also in that situation at the moment. Now, ironically, for many of us, we come from isolated environments. We work from home. We work in studios. We are the isolated group of people out there. So many of us not so much affected by this, except if you're like Dimitri, who has children and you like to break away from home and go uh, out and then come back. <laughs> I'll touch on that a bit. Uh, a bit. You know, I, I, I left this slide uh, specifically because I wanted to ask you about the flying. I, I know that you you had um, you had a, a trip to America lately, uh, one two months ago, something like this. Yeah, I, I presume yeah. you didn't uh, you didn't walk to US, right? You you flo you. Uh no, I made it all the way. I made it all the way to New Jersey, Secaucus there, and uh, I flew directly from Cape Town. But like I said, I, I'm a nervous wreck before I get on an air airplane, and I don't like to talk to people. I don't like to chit-chat on an airplane. I just like to stay alive, and somehow I have no control oh. over that. And I think my fear of flying is not so much the flying. It's actually that I don't have control over that. And then after that, I came back and I went to Ethiopia. Same thing. So yeah. I go into the zombie mode. So the irony is the things that we don't like doing, we end up doing all the time. And uh, that's the situation we are in. So for me at the moment, the only problem I have with our lockdown is I cannot go walk the dogs at the morning. And they are so confused why they cannot go for a walk. So, yep, that's my situation at the moment. And our man of the hour, Demi, good evening again. Yep. Uh, thanks for being here, guys. Uh, most of you know about me. I'm one of the co-founders here at Breezy. I have a... Uh, extraordinarily beautiful and uh, wife and two kids, uh, great family. Uh, I'm also uh, these days uh, between work. I'm uh, schooling one of my of my kids, uh, so uh, basic math and reading. It's uh, I, I can tell you right now that teachers uh, need a raise after this uh, mess. So basically, <laughs> it's yeah, yeah, it's uh, hands down they they need they need a, a raise. And uh, yeah, basically, I'm adapting. Uh, I'm adapting to this new new lockdown thing and this new world where we're living in. Uh, as you said, uh, uh, very very good uh, GP that we are somewhat uh, um, in a in a permanent lockdown, right, with our jobs uh, in, in a sort of way. But I've, I've discovered these days that. Uh, it's uh, it's very funny because it's uh, all this situation is playing tricks on my on my brain because I don't go a lot uh, out a lot right uh, usually but uh, it's 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 um, kind of distressing to not be able to to go out uh, at all right it's uh, yeah it's a bit uh, it's a bit tricky but uh, what can you do we need to be socially responsible and uh, uh, stay home and uh, this will uh, will definitely will definitely pass. I think it's typical human behavior. The moment we cannot have something we wanted, it's mm -hmm. like I was telling my wife today, yeah, I sure. want ice cream, things like that. <laughs> yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. Right, Dimi, so, you are uh, in charge. Yeah, I'll, I'll, Let's move on. Yeah, I'll take it from here with the slides. Uh, yeah. I wanted to, we, we discussed it uh, in the office and uh, GP and I and uh, with, uh, with our colleagues and we wanted to put this this slide first because uh, it's important to know that anything we discuss further on, uh, even uh, uh, the cool things that uh, we maybe will show them at the end, uh, 
have uh, no impact on on what we are working on and what it is planned, right? So uh, we are working on dates. I think there will be one or two, but uh, maybe two smaller up. They will add um, uh, these points here. I'm not sure working in draft, maybe that will come a bit later. Uh, I'll, I'll just go through them uh, very fast. Uh, page redirect is a long awaited feature. For example, if you this will help if you come, uh, you have a domain or a project currently, you have it somewhere or anywhere, and you want to move it to cloud, you want to, to create your website in cloud. Um, now there is there are some some issues with the red regs. For example, you have if you have a URL uh, uh, slash about slash uh, page na name, you can't uh, users that will will uh, will come to that page after you move to to the cloud uh, project will uh, will be redirected to a 404. So this will let you create redirects from your old uh, URLs to your new URLs. And this helps in a bunch of different ways. One, uh, the clients or your visitors will be able to, to pass through those URLs and come to your new website on Breezy Cloud uh, on one hand. And on the other hand, it will, uh, it will also pass some um, SEO juice from, from those URLs to, to the new one. So that's a plus as well. Custom links. I'm sure you guys, uh, you guys uh, wait, uh, wait this for for some time now. Uh, custom links refer to the menu, right? We we are adding some uh, some nice improvements there. Uh, custom links will be one of them. So you'll be able to link not only pages you create in Breezy Cloud in the in the menus, but uh, in the menu element, but uh, also add custom links there. And uh, that will enable you to create those nice uh, landing pages uh, with uh, scroll, uh, anchor score, scroll you know, on the page and things like that. We are also adding uh, vertical menus, an option to put the menu uh, horizontally or, or vertically. That will help a lot when uh, we'll have another thing we're working on, like uh, mega menus or tables or, okay, I'll, I'll just stop here. <laughs> Uh, the next one is custom pages. Right now, you can't control the design uh, uh, of 404 pages. Or, for example, if you are if you are working on the website, uh, you need to publish it, and uh, anyone that knows the links, uh, the link to your website will access it. Uh, but uh, when we'll introduce this maintenance mode, you will be able to to uh, to enable it and uh, work in you basically work in the back end, but have a page in maintenance mode. You'll do an update. You'll uh, I don't know. You need uh, uh, or you want to put a coming soon page uh, up there until you you finish uh, the final touches on your website. So. Uh, a nice feature there. Uh, it will introduce email notifications. R right now, as you know, uh, leads, uh, they, are, they are stockpiled uh, and uh, we save them in your leads dashboard, in, in the Breezy Cloud dashboard in your leads section. But uh, we, we don't notify when a new lead comes, right? So you basically need uh, to do the extra mile to come verify if you have a new lead and things like that. And uh, I know that for some, uh, some of you that, um, that work with uh, that are marketers or growth uh, hackers or uh, and they generate a lot of leads it's kind of troublesome right to uh, to not receive uh, notifications when leads come and we'll have something uh, you'll be able to set uh, when notifications will come maybe one at once a day once a week something like this Google uh, sitemap, your website sitemap this is another thing that uh, helps the uh, Google and SEO this will be done automatically. Uh, uh, the, who, who, the guys that you 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 already know how this works. Uh, we generate a sitemap for your website and and uh, store it on on the server. When Google comes, it, it helps uh, Google see what's there, what's on your website, pages, links, and things like that. And another important feature that uh, that we want to introduce, and this I think will come with uh, because it's linked. The last one, the working in draft mode. Right now, you, for example, as you know, you when you create a project, uh, you work directly live, right? You need to publish it and then update the projects live. 
but uh, we'll introduce this, work, this uh, draft mode. So you'll basically you'll work in draft. No one will uh, will access uh, your project until uh, they're logged in. But it will come. Uh, I, I think not in these two smaller updates. It will come later on with uh, with the sync feature between WordPress and uh, and, uh, and cloud uh, because they are uh, they are linked. Uh, some functionality there is linked, and uh, we need to bring that, those uh, together. That's about it with uh, what we are working right now. These updates are uh, just to give you a, a time frame, but please, please take it with, <laughs> with a grain of salt. Uh, maybe it would not be wise to give you one, but uh, just to give you a, a ballpark figure, I think two, maybe three weeks uh, up to a month, we'll have both updates, uh, uh, both these updates with the first points. What will come next? Uh, we'll continue to work on uh, funnels. Uh, I know that you guys are waiting for funnels functionality for some time, and it will come. But uh, funnels are um, are uh, how to put it uh, are not so light to tackle. We need to do this right, and and uh, we need some more time there. Plus, uh, they are uh, they are um, uh, linked to the heap with analytics, right? If you have funnels and you don't have analytics. You basically don't have funnels because uh, you can't uh, you can't analyze and uh, see all the data who comes in the funnel, uh, where where they exit, how to optimize it, and things like that. So funnels and analytics uh, need to come together. It's a must. So and after this, uh, we'll have. Um, uh, email, email integration for contact form. I'm not sure if in the same update, but uh, uh, we are working on this as well. Um, you'll be able to basically link the contact form with uh, with your um, with your email. Uh, you'll be able to send uh, the form directly on your email. Uh, I think you'll be able to set uh, your own email servers or add uh, Gmail integration, if if I'm uh, not mistaken. But to stay up to date with uh, with uh, all this, go to our uh, Breezy Cloud Roadmap. You can search it on Google. It's uh, If you put Breezy Cloud Roadmap, it will uh, pop up uh, the first one in Google, and uh, you'll find it. There are a lot of things, smaller things, that we are working on on the builder side. For example, uh, the builder team is working on uh, a couple of elements, like table. We'll have a table element. We'll have a mega menu for the menus. Uh, we'll have a, a bunch of other uh, of other smaller things, improvements that uh, I didn't mention here. Uh, but uh, uh, check out the roadmap. We'll uh, we try to keep that uh, up to date, and uh, you'll uh, you'll get a sense of an insight of what we are working on. Uh, okay, let's move to the <laughs> to the to the to the good part. Uh, any question, GP? I'm sorry, uh, mate. I didn't. Uh, sorry, guys. I, I didn't have time to to check the chat. I see that it moves very fast. But uh, if there are some I questions, was thinking, GP, uh, yeah, I think uh, maybe we can questions, but I'm writing them down, so I'll throw them to you near the end. Okay, makes sense. Okay, so let let's get to the to the to the good part. Breezy Cloud CMS. It sounds like uh, so uh, bombastic, right? It's, uh, but this was the this was the plan, and this is the plan to 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 create the first free cloud content management system. We uh, we didn't see we uh, to my knowledge there isn't any right now on the on, on the market. And I want to tackle uh, to tackle these two terms uh, and break them down and finish that finish with with uh, the change the change we've made to 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 follow this vision. We'll uh, discuss a bit about the CMS part first, and then uh, a bit on the free part. So let's start with uh, with the CMS part. As uh, GP mentioned uh, at the beginning, this is a. Is, it's so used this this CMS uh, thing, but uh, in layman terms, in simple terms, is basically a tool that uh, uh, helps uh, us all to create and manage and modif modify modify content on a website uh, without the need of knowing uh, coding or having any technical knowledge. Right? Uh, examples of CMSs, uh, you know, 
WordPress comes to mind, but there is Joomla, Drupal. There, there are there are a bunch of uh, of those out there. When we are talking about uh, content, uh, we uh, breezy. When we are talking about content, we are talking of all the parts, right? We are talking about blogging. We are talking about pages, uh, products for shopping, uh, payment uh, integrations with third parties. We are talking about the marketing uh, segment, like funnels, pop-ups, stories, whatever that is. We'll see and so on and so forth. So basically content is a general term for everything uh, that you will be able to create or manage in, uh, in uh, the content management system. And this is already, uh, if we wait for a big uh, champagne opening, oh, God, today we've started the CMS. No, the CMS part already is there, started. We still develop it, we, uh, we improve it. And uh, for example, we have pages, where you can create websites, we have uh, pop-ups, uh, you'll be able to create funnels in the in near future and so on and so forth. Blogging, blogging will be added later this year. So the CMS part is there and we, and we are continuously develop it and, uh, and uh, and improve it uh, until it will be a whole, uh, a full fledged, uh, full fledged product. Uh, and I, I've, I've put here a bullet point to time frame just to make an idea of, of the the time frame needed. We, uh, if you consider uh, the big uh, players in the in the world that uh, they develop uh, their CMSs in 10, 15, 30, 15 years already, WordPress I think it's out for. 15 years already. So we are trying to do this uh, with uh, somewhat limited resources and team members uh, in a very short period of time. And uh, I think we'll need this year and next year to, to bring it at, uh, at, full, uh, at full speed. But uh, we'll have uh, the, uh, most of it, uh, uh, most of it, uh, hopefully ready by uh, by uh, beginning of uh, 2021 right dimi while you are taking a breath there yeah i two questions that and one i will also tackle tackle and then you can add on to it guys yeah, the one question that we have to take from the beginning is that you are not going to bring in wordpress plugins into brizzy cloud right these are two total different systems and that thing of, if you think of any of your favorite plugins that you use in WordPress, uh, translation plugins, WooCommerce, they will not work in Brizzy Cloud. And I want to say they will never work in Brizzy Cloud because if WooCommerce wants to work with Brizzy Cloud, they will have to write a total new plugin for that. And, and that's just not going to work. So that's the first thing. It's very important. I see many questions coming here about bringing my favorite WordPress plugin into Brizzy Cloud. That's not going to happen. These are two completely different platforms. Dimi, do you want to add something on that? Because I see this question coming all the time. Can I bring this plugin in? What can I do with my favorite yeah, WordPress uh, plugin? I think it's, it was a bit my bad because, you know, uh, when you, we, you have your head around it every every single day, you tend to presume some things and uh, I've, uh, it's my bad. I should have maybe started with that. And I thank you a lot, GP, for, for uh, putting that out there. Uh, Breezy Cloud is uh, there's nothing to do with WordPress, right? It's uh, it's basically not in WordPress environment. It's uh, and you know part of it is uh, that was the idea. <laughs> this part of it, this uh, this project is that was the idea, not to be WordPress, right? Uh, and made with uh, maybe PHP or made with and. We, we are trying to, 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 to create a CMS in the cloud with a static output, but uh, it's not WordPress. So uh, if you're thinking of uh, some plugins to bring there, <laughs> it's a no-no. Everything that will be there needs to be developed from scratch by us, or in the future, if we'll have an API, and uh, if we'll have an API, and I, I'm not talking here about a third-party API for for WordPress, this is a different API. If we'll have that, uh, third-party developers will be able to develop apps for Breezy Cloud, but uh, 
but it's yeah, it's outside the, of WordPress environment. This is very right, and that that's actually a question that was asked: What is the possibility for an API in the future for Brizzy Cloud? Uh, we are discussing about this. I can't. Sh- I can't. Uh, I'd like it to be there. It's. Uh, it might be a, a very important. Uh, uh, if you think about it, a very important uh, deve- the, um, uh, growth uh, growth uh, possibility, right? If you if we develop this API and uh, put it in the hands of developers, uh, a bunch of incredible things may come out. I'm sure of it. Maybe you, we can take the. I I, can, I I always go to the WordPress as an example. Maybe it's not a, it's not the best thing because they. Uh, Maybe that's why the confusion, but uh, it's a good example because look, uh, if you, it's open, then you can uh, you can develop for it. Look how uh, great uh, and uh, amazing things are developed for WordPress, and I'm um, I'm sure the cloud will uh, Breezy Cloud will be will uh, will be the same. It's a bit more I trickier think- in the cloud because uh, we are dealing with uh, uh, with more sensitive things, with servers, with uh, uh, everything is uh, is managed by us, and um, it's a bit trickier here. But uh, yeah, I, I I can't see why we could not do it and we should not do it. It's uh, just a matter we are discussing it, but I can't uh, I can't put a finger on it to say it will definitely be right. Thank you for that. Just quickly for you guys who joined late, and I also forgot to mention this at the very beginning, that this is recorded. Is it your first time here? We always put this within a day or two on YouTube, so you will be able to check the slides. I see Jotte said he wants to take down notes. No, you don't have to take down notes. There's no test after this. (laughs) You can just go watch YouTube again in the future. Quickly, before we continue, one more question that I'm quickly going to answer is, what's the difference between Brizzy Cloud and Brizzy Builder? Brizzy Cloud is the the system. It is the framework. And Brizzy Cloud is part of, a uh, Brizzy Builder is part of Brizzy Cloud. And the Brizzy Builder is where you build your page. That's where you bring in your images, you bring in your text, you put in buttons, you put in your colors. So everything on the design and building of your page that is the Brizzy Builder. We we call it the Brizzy Builder, and the Brizzy Builder is within Brizzy Cloud. So the two, when we when we talk about Brizzy Builder, we talk about how your page will look. When we talk about Brizzy Cloud, we talk about how can you create a menu, how can you create sub accounts, how can you access your builder. So the two are very much related, but they have slightly different functions. Yeah, right. basically we've created this builder, right? This tool that will let you create pages, web uh, web pages without uh, coding skills or uh, technical skills. And uh, uh, because we've created uh, with a technology that uh, is called React, it's on JavaScript React JS, uh, it permits us to put this builder in different systems, right? We chose WordPress, for example, to create a WordPress plugin with uh, Breezy Builder. But um, being very versatile uh, and uh, was created in a way that it lets us uh, uh, remove it from uh, from WordPress, for example, and uh, create a standalone application like Breezy Cloud, or maybe I don't know. You can uh, just just to make a point. I'm I'm not saying that it will be done, but just to make a point. Uh, we could theoretically take it and uh, I don't know, create a builder in Joomla. WordPress. Right. So two questions related that. to the CMS part. The first one is we you have here blogging pages, etc. Question is security. Uh, what is done in terms of security for the CMS? Uh, in terms of security of the CMS, it's uh, we'll, we'll we'll get to that part a bit later because uh, when we're talking about the free part, we're talking about you. Uh, securing your uh, your uh, your server because uh, it will happen. Uh, it will happen. Uh, the output will will be on your server in the in the free part. But on the on the pro part, if you choose to come in Breezy Cloud and uh, choose to use uh, and link your custom domains with the projects and host it on our platform on Breezy Cloud, all the servers and everything we use are uh, are uh, top notch technologies. Uh, and we use Amazon uh, web servers, they're handling every little thing, thing, everything. 
they are handling everything, all the security and uh, uh, it's top notch. All the businesses in the world and uh, are using uh, Amazon Web Services and uh, web servers, and they uh, uh, they have uh, security there. Uh, security there to uh, it's it's basically uh, uh, top notch, right? You we, we are not doing anything uh, right here. Uh, we are basically letting uh, Amazon handle uh, this part of. Uh, Great, and that actually answered many questions regarding the servers. So you guys that had been looking at yeah, that, you know, it's it's like in yeah. everything. Why why you try to reinvent the wheel? We we would not do it as best as as the best in the business, right? It's it would be stupid to to take this security and uh, servers to take it on uh, on our uh, on, under our uh, umbrella, right? We'll focus on the product. And uh, we'll let the professionals focus on uh, on security servers, uh, uh, CDN, uh, image optimizations, and things like that. Great. Thanks, Dimi. Let's move on. Yeah. So we've touched. I'll, I'll go back a bit. Just one slide. Uh, we are talking about Breezy Cloud CMS. And we uh, just a reminder, and we want to make this the first free cloud content management system. We've touched on the cloud, uh, on the CMS part. In this slide, and in the next slide, I, I want to talk about the, a bit about the, about the free part uh, of this. Uh, you know, if you consider, if you take a, a minute to consider what uh, all the successful CMSs out there uh, brought to the table in the in the past years, and forget about uh, features, the funnels, whatever, pages, men, whatever, forget about it. They brought something fundamental to everyone's hands. They brought the possibility to 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 end uh, the power to let you get online, right? So uh, this is uh, this is uh, the vision we want to to attend to. We want to remove first of all. We want to remove the gateways to 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 let you do the most essential thing uh, of a, of a free CMS. Uh, and that is to empower anyone or you or everyone or anyone that wants to create a web presence, right? To, to get online for free. I think this is uh, the fundamental thing that, uh, that, uh, that is important to, to, to follow here. And this is, uh, this is the, the free part of the, we follow this, uh, we follow this, but I'll, I'll touch on the next slide a bit. We follow this with landing pages in cloud. If you know the free account uh, lets you create landing pages, but we've changed the, the, the free part, the free uh, plan a bit, and I'm sure you're, you'll love that. And we are also uh, uh, looking into, into offering free publishing options. So if you consider how, how uh, CMS works right now at this point, anyone, let's take uh, WordPress, right? For example, what do you do? You download it and you need the hosting that you'll pay for it and you need an, uh, a domain, right? So you'll install WordPress on your hosting and uh, you'll, uh, you'll pay for that, uh, for that hosting. But we, are, we want and hopefully we'll, uh, we'll go a step further in, we are looking into ways of offering free, free publishing options outside of Breezy Cloud. So basically you'll, you'll not be uh, strong armed to, to use our platforms and, uh, and go pro, but uh, you'll be able to use the sync feature that is free and, uh, and uh, sync it or either your server or on a free publishing option that uh, we'll discuss on a later date because uh, I can't uh, divulge <laughs> too much right now. Uh, the important part here is that um, the, how, how Breezy Cloud is created and uh, this, uh, this new way of doing things in the cloud and outputting static CMS, uh, static, uh, static output. So basically all the, the files that uh, users will access will be static. This creates a huge amount of possibilities in terms of speed and optimization in security in uh, free publishing. It's uh, where we are, we are very excited about. And as a time frame, as you know, I've put a, a time frame on the other slide as well. As a time frame, it is right now because I'm very, very proud to, to, 
to to tell you guys that we've opened the free uh, forever plan in the cloud and now you can every anyone that wants can create unlimited free websites and uh, what this means unlimited free websites uh, because it's a simple simple term but uh, it is very important because it hides it hides a couple of important changes uh, in terms of vision uh, for example, uh, te- on the technical part, we've, uh, we've added a menu element in free, uh, a menu that uh, was not in free because uh, it was in pro. So right now, if you go to Breezy, uh, to Breezy Cloud on a free account, you'll, you'll be able to create a menu. You'll be able, we've unlocked the pages functionality. So of course you, you can't build a website, right? GP without, <laughs> without pages. So it's, uh, it's kind, it's kind of hard. So you, you can create multiple pages and add them in a menu, menu. So you can create a website. Uh, in this plan, we've also made this change. We've removed the custom domain. So basically it works like, uh, any other CMS you, what? you use it. Wait, wait, you need to yeah. go back because I think some people miss this. Yeah. From now on in the free plan, you can create multiple pages and you will be able to link them in a menu like a normal site with various exactly. pages. You, right now, starting today, you can create unlimited free websites in Breezy Cloud. Websites, what, what does a website have? Let, let's, let's break it down a bit. It has a menu, right? That has a couple of pages, whatever. It has um, a page functionality, right? So you can create those pages and put them in a menu. It has, uh, what does it has, have? It has uh, different uh, pages uh, with services, uh, content, whatever. You can create that. We, ha- you ha- we have over 80% of uh, elements uh, are in free. So uh, you don't have uh, pro functionality of the builder here, so, right? So you don't have uh, a certain pro element or... Um, or you you don't have a pro design, but you have all the free elements and all the free design that uh, we give in in Breezy Cloud. You can use us to create that to create content. And uh, what comes to mind, uh, you correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, maybe you'll need a contact form, right? That uh, everybody out there blocks uh, under a pay gate. No, you 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 know that we have the contact form in free for some time now. So it's only the, if you want to link the contact form with uh, MailChimp or other platforms, that is in pro. But the actual contact form with all all those uh, uh, juicy and nice options with uh, radio boxes and recaptcha and all that is in free. So basically you'll be able to create a website from start to finish with the, the breezy free, uh, with the breezy free plan exactly how you can do it with the with the wordpress cms right or with drupal or with whatever you take it and you can create with it a website uh, from start to finish this is the the point here the point here is to to basically empower anyone to be able to to get online to create to get a web presence for free that's absolutely sure. amazing. So, yeah, but for sure, this- you, you want pro functionality, you want funnels, you want that's another deal, right? That's uh, right. professional deals, that's uh, studios, web uh, professional, they work with clients, that's a totally different deal. But if you want today to create a website for free, uh, you can do it uh, in Breezy Cloud with no limitations. All right, great. So, what about the remove custom domain? What does that mean? Uh, this means that we, uh, uh, by opening this segment, this uh, this part. Let me just go back a slide. By opening this free part, right, where we we removed the the paid uh, gateways from different uh, functionalities and options uh, from the builder, to let you create that free website the same way you do with uh, with free CMSs out there. Uh, we needed to, to, to put the break on custom domains and include those custom domains only in the pro plans, right? Because uh, this is what you do with, uh, with, uh, with CMS, with uh, content management systems, right? You, can, you have this free version of it. You can use it to create a website, but you'll do it either on your server, like you do it with uh, other CMSs like WordPress or so basically you'll use how you'll do it on your server. You'll use the server sync option, GP, you know about it, right? You'll, you will give you a script that is free 
you'll download it and put it on your web server. Mm -hmm. And uh, the project from Breezy Cloud uh, automatically syncs to, to, your web, uh, uh, to your web servers in real time. So basically what you'll do only once uh, at the beginning of the project, you'll take the script and put it on your server in a folder. And then from that point on, everything you edit in, in that project in Breezy Cloud Platform, it will get synced on your, on your web server. So basically, you'll be able to create the website for free in Breezy Free and sync it on your web server for free. You have the files are yours on your web server. So basically, you'll, you'll own them. And uh, this is a, a way to publish uh, free publishing uh, in Breezy Cloud. But uh, my last point on this slide is uh, we are looking in, uh, to add a couple of free publish publishing options that will, will not require you to pay, uh, to pay for hosting, right? It's, it's uh, all around this static content output. We are looking at right. some uh, uh, static uh, servers integrations with different third party uh, providers. We are in contact and we are discussing partnerships. And I will not, uh, I will not go too much into details right now, but we are looking into this uh, possibility. So basically, if we were to draw a line here, what you need to do to have a website today for free, uh, granted that we'll add uh, these uh, free publishing options in the near future and we, we will do our best to, to put them there. I'm, I'm looking at this slide and, and sorry if I'm jumping it, uh, I see the block unlimited websites and then unlimited external pop-ups and then unlimited alert bars. Yeah, sure, sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm, these were there already. We didn't change anything there. I've, I've only point, pointed out the unlimited websites um, as, a, as a change because uh, uh, previously uh, uh, we, we didn't have right unlimited websites. So you could create only landing pages in, in the free account. Uh, but yeah, you, you're right. You, you, you can create unlimited external pop-ups right now. You know, uh, you had a webinar last week about this. I'm not sure if you guys, uh, if you guys uh, uh, attended, but you can, uh, it's already published on, you know, on our YouTube channel, so you can uh, go there and check it out. Uh, what this product is, unlimited external pop-ups, uh, you can create pop-ups. Uh, and uh, you can, uh, this product is to be embedded in uh, in the websites external of Breezy Cloud, right? So you'll create a pop-up with nice uh, automatic trigger conditions and things like that, and you'll embed uh, and publish that pop-up on your current website. It doesn't matter if you have a website uh, on uh, Wix, uh, Squarespace, WordPress, whatever. It doesn't matter as long as you have access to to input that embed code. You'll you'll have an external pop-up, so you can you can. Go check it out right now. And unlimited uh, alert bars are uh, are based on the same um, the same functionality of uh, of uh, external pop ups. You can create those nice uh, alert alert bars promoting a, um, I don't know a discount or a webinar or whatever, and you'll create them in Breezy Cloud and then embed them on your website external of Breezy Cloud. So basically, uh, you'll you'll be able to use this all this. Uh, all these uh, products. Uh, again, with the free uh, builder functionality, right? You will not have design, premium design that we include there. You will not have uh, certain elements uh, that are, um, are only in Pro, and you will not have certain integrations like form integrations or, uh, right? So uh, those are the limitations in terms of Pro features in the builder, but not, uh, not in using the, the platform. And of course, uh, a last thing I want to mention here, and this is very important, I'm glad I didn't forget, um, is that uh, anyone that uh, has uh, all the, cha the changes we've made, uh, uh, we've made changes to, to this free plan, in Breezy Cloud, and also to the to the personal plan. So basically, if you if you own custom domains and decide to upgrade to the personal pro plan, you'll get only three custom domains. We we are looking at this as a 
as the the term implies right you personal you are using that for a personal pro- pur- purpose right you you create a website for yourself or for a friend or uh, or for a family member so it's basically personal use so we have limited the custom domains that you can attach to three domains not uh, not unlimited but if you go further on the on the scale to to the next plan that is studio plan uh that didn't change because that gets everything right it gets unlimited everything unlimited uh, custom domains unlimited everything on our uh, on our uh, hosted on our on our system on our servers uh everyone that has an active subscription right now uh, as i'm sure you know if you have an active subscription in breezy uh, with breezy right now uh you get both right if you if you, it happened you wanted to purchase, for example, if you wanted to purchase uh, a Breezy WordPress plugin, for example, you get uh, one year of Breezy Cloud complementary as a, as a gift from us, basically. And uh, right now, you purchase both plans. So if you go to, if you go to purchase uh, Breezy Personal, you'll get the WordPress plugin Personal and the Breezy Cloud Personal. So they are basically linked. You get both uh, both uh, both platforms in one purchase, but uh, uh, we are discussing to separate them basically. So in a couple of months, uh, most likely we'll have them uh, as a two separate purchases. Uh, so if you want uh, Breezy WordPress, you'll go buy that. If you want Breezy Cloud uh, access to the Breezy Cloud pl- platform. Uh, You'll you'll need to buy that uh, separately, but uh, more on this uh, more on this later. Anyway, if you have right now an active subscription, either personal or either uh, studio, no matter the change, you will still get those uh, those. Uh, so basically, all the changes apply going forward. No, we don't apply changes going back. So, for example, the personal plan in in, uh, in Breezy Cloud had unlimited uh, custom domains until uh, we've made this change uh, today, right? So you'll still get, as long as you don't unsubscribe, you'll still get unlimited uh, custom domains uh, on that uh, on that plan, e- uh, even if we change it to only three domains. So basically all the changes we've made will apply going forward. This is important to mention because uh, we received uh, we received uh, these questions uh, a couple of times and uh, uh, yeah that's about that's about it uh, GP uh, I think this this uh, this this brings something to the table that uh, that uh, that will be in a sort of way revolutionary on this on this side because. Uh, there is no, uh, there is no uh, cloud CMS out there uh, on how we want to to build it, and it's uh, you can fight it for free on on this freemium model, right? You have, you can do the basic and fundamental thing for free, and that is create a website, and then if you need the extended and further functionality, uh, you you go pro. But um, I think this. Uh, this is awesome. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Any questions, uh, GP? You're talking so much. I think you need to drink something there first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, I, I, I have my coffee with me. The, the big question will be in terms of the pricing. We know that there will be more about that as, as it rolls out. How will the changes affect the people who had bought the AppSumo deal last year? No, life- no change. No, no change. change. The the yeah. same the same rule applies across the board, right? Any license that you get, you got when you got it, those terms apply will will continuously apply across the board as long as you stay subscribed. Of course, if you, for example, you have a personal plan, and you you had unlimited the uh, custom domains, and you you unsubscribe. The next time when you come to subscribe, of course, you'll subscribe to the new to the new plan. So basically, you'll uh, you'll get the new condition, the new the new limitations and conditions and uh, terms. But if you, in the case of uh, the AppSumo deal, uh, that plan is lifetime, right? So so you you are subscribed already. You don't have to to worry about it. You'll. Uh, 
Yeah. So, Dimitri, the one question Jason had asked earlier, and I, I know this is often a question that consumers have, how can a free CMS like this be sustainable as a business? How, how does... Uh... Yeah, I, I oh, mean, oh, it does, oh, okay. I, I can I can answer it with uh, with uh, with with one question. The WordPress, how how do, does it? Is, isn't it the same? You have a free version and you have a pro version. Is the same? Is the same? The same freemium model is exactly the same freemium model, right? Think about it a bit. You have a free version that lets you create or lets you use the builder and use the tool to create a fundamental thing that is important. And you also have a pro version. And I think uh, we offer a lot in free for the for the majority of the of the users, right? That uh, it's possible you, you will not need pro uh, ever. If you want to create a basic uh, uh, website really fast or even for a client, it's it's perfectly fine. But we also bring some. I think we bring some some tools in Pro that uh, freelancer freelancers, professionals, and uh, and uh, marketers and growth hackers will appreciate a lot. And I I think uh, they will want to upgrade, right? And considering the uh, you are looking maybe uh, J, uh, sorry I didn't uh, I'm not sure I called the name Jason. Yeah, Jason. Right. Jason, uh, Jason, maybe you you are looking at, um, at the pricing, right? Uh, and when you see forty nine a year and ninety nine a year, compared to I don't know, uh, take ClickFunnels that uh, has a way subpar building experience, way subpar, uh, and they are one hundred and uh, one thousand and two hundred a year. Uh, don't uh, don't think that we'll stay at, the, at this price range. We'll not go. We'll not go there for sure. At uh, the the price, uh, at the price at ClickFunnels or other other businesses like this that offer uh, limited functionality at a huge at huge price. We want to make it affordable, but we will not stay uh, at forty nine and nine and ninety nine per year. And that's one of the reasons why uh, the product already is uh, starting to mature. And we want to 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 separate it from uh, from the the WordPress part. So basically, right now you are uh, creating a subscription that will give access to both, and that doesn't let us um, uh, uh, increase pricing on the cloud. Right? You can't purchase the same uh, the same product and uh, pay two different prices. But uh, we'll uh, we'll separate those in in a while, in a couple of months, when we'll have probably when we'll have the Breezy Pro 2.0 launch, and this is uh, just around the corner. And when we'll separate those, we'll uh, we'll also start to think about increasing the pricing as we add more functionality. So uh, I, I'm not afraid about uh, about the sustainability. It's. Uh, uh, it's something new for sure in this space, in, in this cloud space. But uh, you need to you need to 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 turn the table. Uh, when, you know when we're you're uh, you're starting to to enter a, an hugely uneven, hugely uneven fight, right? It's basically right. a, a David versus Goliath uh, uh, fight right here. The only way the only way to to to, to turn some heads is is by basically. Uh, messing up the table, turn it basically go crazy and turn the table around, right? So, right, good. Let's move on. I see our time is uh, we're five to seven, and I think there's still some goodies that we want to look at, and you want to cover a few more yeah, things. Yeah. Um, yeah, sorry, guys, I, I like to talk a lot, but I'm it's only because I'm I'm very, um, very excited about uh, about uh, about uh, the discussions we're having here and and how. Uh, what are the plans for for Breezy Cloud? Right. So before we go, one question. I think uh, when you get there, uh, I'll have one or two questions that came up many times, and I know there are many questions about functionality. We'll try and cover that in videos, guys. So there's a lot of stuff we'll have to roll out. A lot of videos due to the changes. So you would have seen on the YouTube channel that we had released a few videos just a week ago. So we are releasing a new set for all of that to show you how to make your pages in Brizzy free. 
cloud if you haven't done or tested that yet. And my advice is really go. It's a it, it's it's different to WordPress where you have to download a local server or set up a local server and you don't even know how that works and then you have to install it and then you can set up WordPress and test it. Brizzy Cloud Free is it's as simple as just registering and you can go and test it out. So you really, really have to just go and play with it. So the question is, Dimitri, for the pro version, probably white label. I mean, I saw white label tonight. This question come up like a million times. So what is, what's the plan on white label? What, what will be the future for white label? Um, yeah. Um, we we have that. I, I know that is uh, there's something that is uh, 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 that is a, a, a long way coming, and uh, the, you guys are, are waiting are waiting desperately for it. Uh, you know what? Uh, we uh, we have so so much on our plates, right? I know that this is a question that is asked uh, asked often, and we have the white label on on the list and. As I've, I've told you before, it will go uh, it will go out probably in two steps uh, because there are different layers of white labeling, right? You, we will we'll probably white label the uh, first uh, the um, the dashboard, the breezy the breezy cloud dashboard. So basically, you'll be able to replace logos and things like that. So when the client logs in. Uh, they'll see a, a GP builder or whatever you want to put there, right? So uh, that that is one layer. Uh, another thing to to tackle is to 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 create a redirect, right? Uh, it's it's odd for for your client to come and um, and uh, put on the link breezy.io. <laughs> he needs to put uh, GP builder.io, right? And let breezy behind the scenes do all the do all the work so there are different kind of kinds of layers uh, uh, and the third layer would be something like to to let you to let you white label the the product itself right to, to sell it to your clients so basically to to create different packs and things like that so and all these three layers come with different uh, time frames energy uh, involvement to to be created and because we, we we had so much on our plates uh, uh, lately, we we pushed that a bit uh, a bit down the line. But uh, I promise you that it, it is there and it will it will get done. Hang in there a bit more and uh, we will do it. We just uh, we just uh, took our time to to develop. A, a, you know, I say uh, a bit more important functionality, but if you look from your point of view, you might say that uh, white label is the most important functionality for you, right? Uh, it's hard to take decisions when you you are in our shoes because we have thousands or hundreds of, of, of different requests and uh, everyone is uh, is uh, is uh, swearing by the importance of every every little thing. So. We need to, to create a priority list and, list and uh, uh, the white label is coming, uh, but uh, we, we still need some time. We still need some time. Maybe after the, the funnels, uh, maybe after the funnels and uh, uh, the analytics, uh, maybe we'll, uh, we'll, uh, we'll squeeze the, the at, least, at, at, at least the first uh, layer or maybe even the second layer to let you control the logos and branding and maybe let you maybe let you also uh, redirect the dom uh, your domain to to breezy cloud breezy breezy cloud maybe those yeah. four first two, two layers and we'll see about uh, the rest later on uh, just quickly to rob i see rob said he just joined now and according to him it starts at seven o'clock e time now rob you didn't make a mistake we we did make a little mistake in our arrangement on this site so yeah, you, you didn't join late. You didn't miss out. It wasn't Google. It was a little bit on our side. But yeah. thanks. For the it was my bad because because uh, where I am, uh, we just uh, we just passed on the on the summer time and uh, the the time frame moved uh, moved up in one hour and I I've messed it up a bit. Uh, sorry about that. Right. We'll have the recording. Worry. Yeah, we'll have the recording. It's uh, on 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 YouTube uh, shortly, maybe tomorrow, something like this. So. Right. And the last word on white label to echo Lisa's uh, statement there. If you guys want to understand the white label 
uh, discussion. You can go check on the Facebook community. I believe when it comes to white label, there are two camps. There is the camp that says, never used it, work with clients my whole life, don't see the purpose of a white label. And then there's the other camp that says, I cannot live without white label. So for it's just something that I think this is the wonderful world of choice. There's a group that loves it. There's a group that doesn't need it. So is white label in the works? The answer is yes. And you, you just have to wait a little bit longer for that, for those guys who are waiting for it. Right. Let's, let's go before we go, Dimitri. Yeah. Before we go. So before we go, uh, you know, we've, uh, we've, uh, Oh, we are always trying to surprise you at, uh, for the ones that uh, you guys stick to the end of, the, of this uh, rant, of my rant. So uh, we are always try, trying to surprise you. And we are, we are always playing and experimenting with different kinds of, uh, of, of uh, things here in, in, in house. And um, we're working and uh, uh, re, uh, replatforming uh, a bit uh, the builder. But it's minor changes, right? Because uh, the builder is so versatile, and, and uh, uh, that that's props to to my colleague Sergi and his team. He, they build it in a way that uh, if we, for some reason, if we come up with with some crazy idea, they just oh, they, this is easy to do. Let give me one day, pack pack, and they'll they'll basically make it happen. It's it's crazy. So uh, thanks, uh, Sergi, for for all that hard work. We we've been playing with this um, with this, uh, this uh, product called Stories. I'm sure uh, it's it's not randomly the name is not randomly picked because I'm sure you heard about uh, Facebook Stories and Instagram Stories. So it's kind of a similar similar thing. We didn't invent invent the the wheel here, but uh, what we've invented is uh, you'll you'll be able to use Breezy to do it. So that will be. Uh, very, very easy to, to create a story like this. What these stories are, for those that don't know, are basically mini, uh, mini bite-sized, um, mini sites or maybe landing pages better uh, that are primarily for mobile access, right? So you'll, you'll be creating them in one, one resolution only and uh, they will be mainly accessed from uh, from mobile and they will bring uh, you can uh, uh, design and uh, create different very nice uh, little uh, experiences uh, there that will complement your your main website right you promote a, a ebook uh, generate a lead or uh, uh, or um, i don't know a service promote a service or things like that and my question is here that's why I, i've put the <laughs> The maybe there at the, at the end, that's why we, we put the maybe, we'll show something. My question is if uh, you guys want to see uh, uh, an early version of this uh, story, I'll, I can show you the, share my screen and show you the builder a bit. And uh, then uh, a couple of, uh, yes, 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 yes. I, I, I think it's settled, right, uh, uh, GP? Yep. It, uh, does a bird fly? Well, ostrich, no. Well, does a fish swim? The answer is yes, definitely. <laughs> the are coming okay, in. let me just uh, just share my screen <laughs> here. But uh, bear with me a minute. I might have uh, I might have uh, share screen. Right, so while you are loading there, yeah, I just please, want please. To, I've got the opportunity as well to see what's going on here. And my first reaction to Dimi was that I had just criticized similar kind of tries that others have tried to do you they tried to do it on desktops and it works very well on a desktop that you can swipe and it can work and the moment you go to a mobile device it fails and when i saw what they had done with this on a mobile device i was very impressed so even on a desktop you will still be able to interact with it but in terms of a mobile device it's going to open a new world in terms of almost like a slideshow Mm -hmm. Can you see, guys? Can you see my screen? It's uh... your screen, but you're showing us the webinar. As yeah, we it's are... okay. It's okay. It's a sort of an inception, uh, like an inception movie, right? You can see, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, mirrors in mirrors in mirrors. Anyway, this this is uh, this is basically uh, this is basically the builder, right? If you're looking looking at it, uh, this is the breezy builder. Yes, but it's not, you you what you create here uh, are basically this this kind of experiences uh, that are only on mobile because you can't see here and uh, 
if you look in the left hand side, you can't see the responsive, uh, right? So what you'll build here, you'll build only in mobile, uh, in mobile, uh, in mobile view. Of course, this is the same builder. You can add different elements. Uh, you can control different, uh, different uh, images, backgrounds, uh, colors. This is exactly the same uh, breezy builder that you guys are used to. But you will not create pages and websites. You'll create this mini, mini, how to put it, mini stories, right? Uh, uh, mini uh, landing pages to promote certain stuff. Uh, uh, can, uh, for example, you can reorder here the the um, the slides if you want, or you can duplicate, or you can delete. This is the same builder. You create these nice little stories that uh, uh, that promote something, a service, a landing page. You can generate leads. You can uh, this uh, I see as a as a complementary option to to use for your website right you can have a website where you have all the information in the world with about us services portfolio uh, whatever you have there every information a client might find might want or might need if they want to get really deep and try to to find more about you but you can also create this nice little story right where you say hi i'm jane i uh, do graphic design and i uh, can help you with this and i can help you with that and look here is a testimonial about me uh, let's get in touch uh, visit my website or i don't know uh, get a quote so this is a sort of a, a mini bite-sized experience that you can deliver to a, a user. Uh, and we know mobile is very, very important nowadays. And you can deliver that to, to him <clears throat> or her in a, in, a, in a story like this. And uh, uh, I think this will be a great thing for, to have on your, in, your tool, uh, in your toolbox. Let me show you how, how it looks on... Um, after you save it and after you create it, and uh, all these are editable, of course, like the same way in, uh, you do it in Breezy. Uh, even if uh, this uh, story uh, story pro uh, product that will sit on your... Uh, by the way, this uh, all, all things that we develop, we develop for cloud and WordPress. So even if it, this is a WordPress webinar, everything that uh, that is related to the builder, it will be in WordPress as well. So this will be a functionality that will be available in WordPress and in cloud as well. But uh, even if this is primarily uh, to be accessed and designed and to be accessed by phone, by mobile phones, uh, we, we, uh, we've created a preview in, uh, in desktop, right? But maybe you ha you'll have a, uh, uh, users or clients that will access this uh, on a desktop uh, on a desktop view, and this is the view that we'll, you'll see on a desktop. You'll basically be able to 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 move from slide to slide to go through the story, and when you'll go to in, in a mobile, I've, I've simulated here a, mo in a mobile in my Chrome browser. You'd get you'd get something like this, right? And you'll be able to move through the story. And I've cre we've created this nice, uh, nice room for your, if you're a web designer, for example, and your clients or visitors will be able to 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 move through this experience and and uh, be able to 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 get an idea of what you're doing, what you're selling. Uh, Right. So this this might be one of the stories. Of course, you can create as many slides as you as you want. But look, we've we've also created a I don't know sort of a top five ideas to do when you are um, when you're staying at home, right? Because it's uh, now it's uh, when you're on lockdown, something like this. So maybe you'll you'll pre you'll present things like this on your. Uh, <clears throat> I'll just go through through the slides. Keep fit. I Keep fit. At the beginning, when you said, "Do they want to look?" the the answer was yes. And now the next question is when. <laughs> yeah, of course. That? Yeah, we'll touch on we'll touch oh, on that. Right when. Yeah. <laughs> so this is another one that uh, these are pre-made. Basically, we we've played uh, this is uh, we've played uh, uh, a couple of days with uh, with the builder and uh, created created this. Bogdan is a wizard in 
uh, he's handling uh, the design part. So uh, as you can imagine, all are top notch. If you're hungry, just close the close the screen right now because it's, uh, it's getting, yeah. As you can see, these are merely examples of how these stories can be used. You can have a restaurant or uh, and present the menu of the day or things like that in a, in a sort of a easy to access and easy to, to grasp uh, story, right? You, if you give a, a, a website link to your clients, ah, there are a lot of pages there. It's okay. It does the job. But if you want to, 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 to narrow it down and actually present something in a, in a very focused way, uh, I think this, this might be a, a tool to, to use, right? Besides your, besides your website. I'll just go, uh, I think this is the third and I'll show another one. We have a couple of more made and we'll ma make some more. Uh, but uh, uh, this is, for example, um, a story for a handyman, right? If you, if you want to find uh, or you, you're promoting uh, an app or something, uh, you can create uh, the, the possibilities. Are <coughs> Sorry about that. The, the possibilities are, uh, are limitless. Uh, I'm sure you guys will find way more better ways to, to, to implement this than us. Uh, you can uh, create onboarding for your apps. You can create uh, different uh, ebooks, presentations, or sell different uh, concerts. Uh, I think we have a concert one, if I'm not mistaken. Let me see if I can find it. I think it's here. Yeah. Look, this is a. Uh, this is a. For example, is a. Um, how do you put it? It's a flyer, right? It's a concert uh, announcing. Uh, a uh, poster right so you can create all sort of uh, sort of things like this and <clears throat> yeah that's that's basically it mini sized uh, uh, mini sized uh, uh, stories are mini mini bite sized uh, experiences that you can create in in this manner uh, on a slide based to 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 promote different projects or different services let me just uh, stop sharing the screen if i stop sharing yeah i'm i'm ho i hope you guys uh, you guys like it we we've put this together in uh in uh, in days right in two two or three days it's uh, and and we didn't do this uh, in two three days uh, uh, I, I don't want to get misunderstood because uh, <clears throat> uh, because it's a, a small thing to do right it's, uh, this uh, this project is complex if you started to do it from scratch but because breezy is such a versatile versatile uh, and is built in such a manner it le it let us uh, it let us uh, do with it uh, different different things like uh, like this story product that will come uh, in in a short while i think uh, we are looking at, yeah, we are looking at uh, i don't know short maybe. very relative at this moment in the yeah, time it's, you know what I, I i'd love to tell you a date and to put uh, the finger on it and to launch it uh, right then on that date but uh, it's as you if we look at, at the history, uh, yeah, it, that's not uh, always the case. Uh, I think maybe uh, with the funnels, one month, two months, maybe. We, okay, we have gonna... it. The builder yeah. is already done, right? The builder is uh, the builder is already stripped down, and we are working. Uh, I I purposely didn't show you how you can create it on the page. I didn't. I, you've noticed that I didn't drag any elements on the page. Uh, that was an in, intended. That was an intended action because I didn't want to show you how you'll create it because that is another thing that is very cool. We are repurposing a bunch of things. It. We. You'll see. I, I didn't want to divulge everything, but. Uh, uh this is a new a new interesting uh, way of uh, using breezy to to engage with your with your audience right uh, and, to, and we love it like heidi says breathtaking right and uh, 
Yeah, it is a tease, Pele. That's what we like to do. And I mean, when Dimitri showed it to me, I, I told him we definitely have to do a teaser on this. And if it was my way, you wouldn't even have seen it. I was going to just run a teaser and, and not tell you anything. But Dimitri had a good heart and decided to show you more tonight. So you guys get to feast your eyes on what's in the works. Yum, yum, right? Yeah, that that's primarily, uh, that's primarily, and I, I'm glad you, GP, because I before we started, right, we've discussed about this and uh, uh, GP agreed we, uh, in showing this and we decided mainly to show it because it's, uh, it's as you saw, it's there, right? You can use yeah. it, you can create things with it and I've shown you a couple of examples that were created with a tool. We didn't uh, do anything else but use use the same uh, the same tool to create those stories, and uh, uh, that's why uh, I have a we have in in house a bunch of other things, but they are in alpha state, so they they can't be shown right now, right? So uh, uh, this will give you an idea that if we showed the, showed it, it's it's nearly nearly there. Right, guys. So sorry, we are running a little bit over time. And I know Alex mentioned, uh, he, you, Alex, you didn't join late. Uh, we we got our times messed up a little bit. So for those who thought they joined late, no, you were on time. And so was the people in the previous video. So we apologize for that. As always, this video is recorded and we will try and put it out by tomorrow, no later than Saturday, so that those of you who had missed anything can catch up on that. So just hang in there. You'll you'll have access to the full video very shortly. Right, Dimitri, are you still there? Yeah, I think we lost Dimitri, uh, and and suddenly I feel very exposed sitting here all alone, and I don't know what to do. It reminds me of the days that I used to work at the radio station, and you put on a record, and you put the needle on the record, and you go to the bathroom, and you come back, and you hear that the radio, that the, the the record got stuck in the loop, and you run back to the studio to go and change it. So kind of the situation. Right, guys, I'm going to try and take it from here. So that was your quick sneak peek into the stories tonight and i i had a little bit of hands on with it and I, like i said i wanted to be a bigger tease actually and show you less but we discussed it's such a great feature and we think it works so well that this is absolutely one of those things going to blow your mind and i want to reiterate what dimitri had said this is for both cloud and for WordPress. So I've seen a lot of comments lately that people are saying we are moving over and focusing only on cloud. It's not true. We are building cloud out as a CMS, as a content management system. But in terms of functionality and builder, both get the same amount of love. I wonder if Dimitri is back. Yep, I'm here. Okay, you're back. Welcome. Uh, yeah, I was, I was talking a bit. On, yeah, <laughs> I was talking by myself a bit I, until I realized that, that I'm off. Yeah. I... Right. So let's quickly just recap this while we're on this. As you've heard tonight, there is going to be price changes for for the cloud, and we and we will discuss this more. But for those guys who got the lifetime deals and the AppSumo deals, do not worry. Nothing changes for you guys. There's nothing to be worried about. We are talking quickly here about the WordPress lifetime licenses, which is going down, down, down. And uh, I, I saw it drop quickly since the last webinar. So, guys, if you're still on the fence about this one, uh, no one can make up your mind for you. You can see Brizzy Cloud is, is fleshing out very nicely. But it, you know me, I'm a sucker for a lifetime deal. So this 299 US dollar deal 687 licenses left and after that you have to consider all the extra functionality that is coming that price is not going to be repeated okay so what what else do we have in store here oh that's me again and that handsome guy next to me is Vito and he will be joining us next week here for a webinar and we'll make sure that you guys get the right time and we're going to discuss the product that they have which is WordPress feedback and just a little bit about it. This is when you are working with clients and you set up their site and maybe they're sitting in a different city or a different office and you want their feedback on how your site looks and, and you don't want to email back and forth 
conference calls back and forth, back and forth. This plugin allows you to work with your client in real time, both accessing your site and getting that feedback on how the sites should look. So Vito is going to join us. He's going to run us through the product. He's going to show how it works on a Brizzy WordPress site. And I see Webiste on your WordPress website. I think that's the correct spelling over there. So join us next week. We will send out a link and a, and a request for you guys joining um, me. I, I, web, webis, oh, my God. I, I butchered that word, but it was in a hurry. So, yeah. Okay, no, I thought maybe it's a different language. I no. should just <laughs> how to pronounce it. <laughs> It's, right. it's fine. I have an excuse. I am not. Uh, I'm, I don't speak uh, English as a primary, as a mother language. So it's uh, it's fine. All right. So we'll talk again about that and let you know. So from my side, thank you very much for joining tonight. Hope our little surprise at the end was a very nice surprise. I'm looking so forward to that because the more and more the tutorials we do, the more I have to tell you guys. Mobile is going to play even a bigger part in our future. I know we're sitting at home now during these lockdowns, so we're probably back on our desktops, but this stories feature is one massive little surprise here at the end, and I hope you're excited about it as I am. Thank you very much. And Dimi, before we go, last words from you. Yeah, thanks a bunch, guys, for, for being here. Uh, stay safe, and uh, we are uh, traveling uh, challenging times uh, right now, but... Uh, Stay safe. We are all in lockdown. We are uh, where uh, the team is uh, working hard to push this. Uh, we are. I was thinking uh, a bit uh, the other day. We are somewhat. Uh, if you, you can see the half full of the glass, right? We are somewhat. Uh, uh, how to put it? We are somewhat. Uh, Help. Help. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Help me a bit, uh, GP. Here we are uh, great, not grateful, but we can do the work from home, right? There are right. a lot of industries that uh, there are in the ground right now. My wife is, for example, working in the hospitality business in a hotel here. Uh, uh, so you can imagine the the traveling and all 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 this is uh, at the ground. Uh, yeah, so. Uh, we are fortunate to be to be able to do some work from home, and uh, it's important to stay safe. And uh, if we can transmit this message, uh, stay in house and uh, uh, endure this lockdown, we'll we'll get past this for sure. And uh, and uh, yeah, we are yeah. here. If you need uh, if you need any help with Breezy, we'll move on. the The development is moving on. Uh, Everybody is working from home, so. Uh, we'll see you we'll see you online and next week